What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Julia and welcome to the very beginning of our garage gym transformation. We just moved into this house in Florida yesterday. This is our garage before and you guys are about to see the entire transformation. We had never even been to this house before we actually moved in and this garage is so much bigger than we expected. We have all of our equipment ordered. I haven't placed the order for our flooring yet, so I'm hoping to do that today. But first, we gotta get this thing cleared out. gym tour. I'm going to quickly run through each piece of equipment and where we got it. All right, first thing I'm going to chat about is the flooring. Now, we actually got our flooring from Tractor Supply, and when we looked it up, we didn't look for gym flooring because if you do that, it is super pricey. So we ended up looking for a horse stall mats. It makes it so much cheaper. And down here in Florida, these pieces, they're four by six, the normal stall mat size, but they were only $49 a piece. I did have to buy eight of them, and we did have to cut four of them. We had to cut a foot off of each of the four on this far side, just so it was a perfect fit in our garage. But even so, it was such a steal getting them for $49 a piece, and they actually delivered them to my house for only $60 total. So if you're trying to build a garage gym, I highly recommend going the horse stall mat route rather than the gym floor mat route because Tractor Supply even had the exact same mats labeled for the gym and they were $250 a piece, whereas these, which were labeled for horse stalls, were only $49 a piece and they were literally identical. So that is the key whenever you're looking for floor mats for your gym. Make sure if you're on a budget to go with the horse stall mats because you will end up saving so much money. That's what we did and we absolutely love them. They are a bit heavy, they're about 100 pounds per piece. That's why we chose to have them delivered and it was well worth the price and I am so pleased with them. All right, next up we have our treadmill. This is the Nordic Track Elite 3700. We actually found this for a steal on Marketplace. I think it's regularly like $2,000. We got it for $330. It was a bit of a pain getting it here because we had to rent a truck because our cars weren't big enough. But this thing is incredible. It goes up to 12 miles per hour and a 15% incline, literally in perfect condition. So freaking happy with this purchase. And it just kind of fits super nicely and it allows us to work on more speed work. Yes, the weather is amazing here. We can run outside all the time, but having this for incline stuff and speed stuff is absolutely incredible. In this front corner, we just have some random stuff that we don't use as often, but we still use. Starting with some dip bars just from Amazon, a weighted vest from Amazon, some battle ropes, those are from Amazon as well. But there is a wall mount if we want to mount those to the walls, but for now, I just kind of wrap them around one of the racks of the squat rack. And then we do have a 60 pound sandbag back here from Go Ruck, as well as a 40 pound like filler bag that you can add to a sandbag to make it a little bit heavier. But that's our front corner. In this front corner, we just have our extra plates that don't really match the rest of ours. I got these from an Amazon brand. They were actually gifted to me. They are great. They're bumper plates and they're H45s. They just don't really match the aesthetic, so I prefer to keep them up front. All right, back here, like I mentioned, we did have to cut one foot off of four of the floor mats. So these are the extras. We sometimes use them whenever we're doing like a deadlift from a platform. We'll build up some of these as well as some of our other bumper plates. And then this hex bar or trap bar is just from Amazon. We got it on sale for I think $90 one day. It was some like crazy prime deal. So that was such a steal. Great quality and it is the normal Olympic size hex bar. So it is 45 pounds. Over here we do have a big mirror. We'll probably eventually mount this to the wall just so we can actually see ourselves in it. But then coming down here, we have the rubber hex dumbbells. So we have a set of fives, tens, fifteens, twenties, and twenty fives. We eventually want to get heavier ones, but we've spent enough money already, so this is a good start. 
We also have two kettlebells. One is 20 pounds, one is 40 pounds, and then we have a 10 pound medicine ball. In this box over here, we just have my barbell pad, some other attachments for our cables, a little TRX strap, and then our resistance bands and a jump rope. And then over here on the ends of our squat rack, we do have just spare plates that we already had from Sports Authority from years ago. These were cameras and we just have three 25 pound plates and two 10 pound plates. We just keep them stacked on here. Unless we need them, then we'll use them. But for the most part, we stick to our bumper plates. And then we have this barbell. So this is actually from an Amazon brand called ET Energic. They sent me this as a gift. Very appreciative of that because I love it. It is the Olympic size barbell, so it is 45 pounds. It does have the knurled design, so it makes it really nice for your grip. Doesn't have the knurled design in the middle, which is great because it doesn't scratch up your back, doesn't scratch up your collarbones. So I'm a big fan of this one. And thank you to ET Energic for actually sending me this a few months ago. All right, now onto some of the bigger pieces of equipment like the squat rack, the cable machine, the bench, and the bumper plates. Those four things are actually all from Rep Fitness. And no, this video is not sponsored by Rep. I purchased everything with my own money, but I cannot say enough good things about Rep Fitness. I've had such an incredible experience with them. So I will have everything linked down in the description box below in case you want to shop any of these pieces of equipment. They're all absolutely incredible. So the number one thing that had me sold with the rep is that everything on their website ships for free. No matter where you are located in the continental United States, everything ships for free. No matter how big or small or what your order includes, it all ships for free, which is absolutely unheard of in terms of fitness equipment because of how heavy everything is. So that was just incredible. My brother actually recommended Rep to me. He lives out in Denver where Rep is based and he has two of their squat racks. He explained how they have the wider base. So they're super sturdy and that's something we really wanted because we wanted a squat rack with the chin up bar attached. So we knew we needed something that wouldn't shake and was super sturdy. So absolutely love that as well. We actually went with the build your own home gym option. I believe that option includes like five or six different things you can get. And the great thing is you don't have to get everything. So a barbell is one of the options. We already had a barbell, so we just opted out of that option. It's very like personalized to you and what you need. So we obviously just got the squat rack, the cable machine, the bench, and the bumper plates. There are so many different squat rack options, so many different rack attachment options. We went with the cable machine. There are different barbell options. There were tons of different benches. We got an adjustable one. And then there were also different weight options, whether you wanted iron plates, whether you wanted bumper plates, and then different combinations of weights, which was absolutely incredible. I forget what the last option was. I think it was just like barbell clips, which we already had a pair from Amazon. But honestly, in love, couldn't be happier with all of the stuff from Rep. So like I said, I will have that all linked down below, but let's take a closer look at everything. All right, so like I said, for all the bigger stuff, we went with the Rep Fitness Build Your Own Home Gym option. There were a ton of different squat rack options. You can either get a plain rack or a power rack. We went with the power rack. This is the PR1000 power rack. So it does have both a front and a back, and it does have the crossbars up top. We have a flat bar here because we needed that for the cable attachment, but we do have a chin-up bar up front, and then we also do have a wider bar we can replace that with if we want an extra challenge for chin-ups or pull-ups. But I think this bar is absolutely perfect. It came with the J-hooks, it came with the safeties. You can adjust them to whatever height you need it at. Same with the J-hooks, and I don't know. I just think it's the perfect distance. The base is nice and wide, it's nice and sturdy. It doesn't move at all whenever you're doing pull-ups and just the distance between these bars is perfect for squatting, bench pressing. We haven't had any issues with it, but it's also still nice and compact, so it doesn't take up a ton of space. All right, in terms of our squat rack attachment option, we went with the 1000 series lat pull down. So it is this cable machine and it attaches right to our power rack. There are two different anchors for the cables. So there's one up top and that's for lat pull downs. It did come with that lat pull down bar. And then there's also one down below on the ground, perfect for rows. We also have those other attachments that we can use if we want to do any other exercises. But whenever you are loading the weights, you just load them right here on the back. It did come with these clips. You can load on any bumper plates, iron plates. It works perfectly. And then using this pulley system, you either row or pull down or whatever exercise you are doing, but it uses that weight as resistance and it is absolutely perfect. Love that it just attaches right onto the squat rack. It saves a ton of space in my opinion. Next up, we have our adjustable bench. So this is also from Rep and it is the AB3100 adjustable weight bench. You can adjust the angle of the top portion as well as the seat. 
So that is super useful, especially for incline bench, incline chest flies, anything like that. We did get it in the matte black finish. All right, and last but not least, we have our bumper plates. So instead of going with one of the sets, because a lot of them were sold out because they were out of 10 pound plates, we ended up just getting a bunch of like pairs. So we got a set of 45s. So we have the other set on the other side of the squat rack, but we do have a set of 45s, a set of 25s, and then we actually have two sets of 15s. My brother got me a set for my birthday and we already had a set, but the 10s were still sold out. So we're hoping to get a set of 10s and a set of fives sometime soon, but those are our bumper plates. Once again, from Rep Fitness, free shipping, super affordable and came in super fast. Also amazing quality, so highly recommend. I will have everything linked down in the description box below. All right guys, that is going to wrap up our garage gym tour, our garage gym transformation. We hope you enjoyed it. This is pretty much how it's gonna look from here on out. I personally love the flow of things. We might eventually get some heavier dumbbells and some heavier bumper plates. For the most part, this is how it's going to stay, and I absolutely love it. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a like, and make sure you are subscribed. I will see you all next time. Bye.